Okay, uh, for my next technology um, uh, tool that I found uh, for my, uh, uh, this will be for my students, but uh, I'd also like to share with, again, you know, coaches and, and my other colleagues if they want to do something like this uh, in their classroom. Uh, it's called Bracket HQ, bracketHQ.com. Um, it allows you to easily uh, uh, group up uh, groups of students and um, organize them into a bracket for any sort of uh, competitive uh, challenge or team building activity. Um, Uh, so, um, for this particular instance, um, I figured uh, uh, it's near the end of uh, summer uh, strength and conditioning, um, and I thought I'd have, you know, my, uh, my football team um, uh, have them do like a tug-of-war challenge, so I made this bracket for, uh, for that. So, um, so, here you can do uh, uh, different... Um, I'll just say, here we go. Um, well, I've already started the tournament, but there's uh, you can do round robin, single, or double elimination. And for this particular instance, I did a uh, group stage. Um, uh, you type in uh, all the information here. Um, you can um, customize and, and shuffle the seating and, and all that stuff here. And, um, I always go dark mode. It's easier on my eyes. Uh, and then there's all, all different kinds of settings, so you can customize it exactly how you'd like it. And of course, this is just the free version. Um, it doesn't cost anything, um, but uh, there's even more if you wanted to if you wanted to pay for the uh, Bracket HQ Pro. Um, and you can even make it uh, so that um, multiple people from multiple places can can put in the results or the scoring and and all that. So um, yeah, so I, I split it up. Um, I split it up between seniors and freshmen, um, and then juniors and sophomores uh, in, in either group. And then I grouped it up again um, by the position that they play. Um, uh, and now naturally, like a, an offensive lineman is going to be bigger and stronger than a receiver um, or or a running back uh, um, for uh, so they'd have an advantage in, in something like tug of war, uh, but um, there are more backs and receivers than uh, than our offensive and defensive linemen. So I figured you know it'll it'll even out. Um, so uh, so yeah so that so it, it's a round robin format and then uh, because a tug of war match will take you know seconds you know um, and at most maybe what 10 20 seconds so it shouldn't take long to run through that and then um, and then uh, they'll seed themselves in this bracket right here uh, so even if you lose you know you're still getting uh, uh, two matches minimum uh, and then we'll you know find the champions so I figured that would be a fun uh, team building exercise for my football players next week so um, oh yeah